Web3 Games have quickly pushed game economies to the forefront of players' minds when evaluating the latest releases. Now more than ever, the need for a well-balanced game economy is critical to any project's future. Machinations is a visual tool specifically built for creating and testing game economies. As a Turing complete system, the 11 objects allow us to simulate any type of game logic. Let's first have a look at the challenges that Web3 game developers are facing. Here we have an abstract view of the typical core game loop. The player completes an action in the game, they are rewarded, the player then has the opportunity to reinvest these rewards in the game. This could be in the form of unlocking the next level, receiving an amazing new sword, or upgrading the character stats. In Web3 projects, we are adding a new path for players that enables them to exchange some of their in-game rewards with other players. Rather than just thinking about one player's progression, games will have lots of these individual progression systems happening at the same time. As new players join at different times, we can end up with a complex combination of different player economies at different stages all the time. These players can now interact with each other through marketplaces and token exchanges to sell their items or even cash out. Players can also buy items via these marketplaces, adding further complexity for game designers to manage. Now one player's activity can impact every other player in the system, as well as external influences of changes in the cryptocurrency marketplaces. Machinations are now working with Web3 game developers to enable them to test their game economies before launch and then consistently monitor their economies for signs of instability. This allows developers to make small, well-tested changes to the game economy to maintain stability well before they get caught in runaway inflation or deflation.